bring you the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. The kicker's got the ball set up, and we're ready to get this thing started. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Kirk, today we get to watch one of the great wide receivers in college football. Freeman's footwork, his great hands, his speed, he is a dangerous offensive weapon. No doubt, Brad. He's really one of the most exciting players to watch in college football. He catches everything that's thrown his way and is a legitimate deep threat downfield to make big plays for this offense. He's going to face some doubles, sometimes even triple team coverage. And I think today, this defense, they... And he scores! Touchdown! Once this kid gets into the open field, you're not going to catch him. You know, some of his critics say that all he has is track speed. Well, let me tell you, speed is speed, as we just saw right there. And he converts the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. McCarthy fields it at the 19. And he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Around the 39 yard line. That brings us second and nine. From their own 39 yard line, it's second down. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. And a quick throw. Four yards on that play. He took what the defense gave him that time, which is okay. It keeps the yards to go a little bit more manageable. third and five situation ball on the 43 they come out on an empty backfield quick throw out to the receiver tackle made at the 46 this is a quarterback who trusts his receivers and he knows they can make plays it's like those two were playing catch out there The D-line did a good job of nullifying out the blocks up front, and that allowed the linebacker to roam free and make the tackle in the backfield. So it's second and 12. Ball on the 48. Scrambling around. Dives forward. Whitaker gains about five yards on the scramble out of the pocket. That makes it 37. He scrambles. And they make the stop right around the 38-yard line. Picks up five on the scramble. And it's the offense that takes the field on fourth down. He's taken down at about the 25-yard line. He kept it himself and picked up a good-looking first down. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. Here's the eighth play of the series. Now he's scrambling. Now he's going to run and watch out. Great job here converting and keeping this defense on the field. They're getting very tired. From the 12-yard line. First down. He's got an opening. And it pays off. Touchdown. Boy, did he 
looked determined running the football. Nobody was going to keep him out of the end zone. The extra point to tie this game up. And he hits the PAT. A nine-play, 62-yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. We get a tie game at 7-7. Nolan is lined up to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20. At the 30. He's tackled at the 33-yard line. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. Makes the catch and look out, and he is drilled at the 37. That makes it second and six. From their own 37-yard line, it's second down. run there. Felder comes away with around five yards on that option keeper. That'll make it third and nine. They'll bring him down at midfield. So he keeps it and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. First and ten. Ball on the 50-yard line. He's still going. Tackle at the 30. He's up to 100 rushing yards now. Brad, this guy has had a game to be able to keep this team in this football game. And before it's all said and done, he could be the difference in the outcome of the game. First and ten. Ball on the 30-yard line. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. McBride gets six yards on the play. That'll make it second and four. Tackled around the 25 yard line. They'll line it up again on third down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Now he tries to buy some time and he dives forward. Brad, I think offensive coordinators spend more time focusing on two areas for the offense third down conversions and red zone offense. And right now, this offensive coordinator has to be really happy with the way this offense is executing in their third downs. That's the second time they've been able to get a first down in this drive on third down. Throws incomplete. That's just a great play to separate the ball from the receiver. He'll be feeling that hit tomorrow. It's the ninth play of the drive. Fires left side. Throws complete touchdown. They pretty much had their way with the defense there. Terrific play. He makes the PAT. A nine-play, 66-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. So our score, 14-7. This game's already shaping up to be a good one as we head to the second quarter. 14-7. Looks Almost like they're ready for the kick. To return. Return. McCarthy from the two. 
And he's taken down at the 19-yard line. Brad, this is my kind of game. I love seeing this kind of production and the way these quarterbacks are playing. Both teams are challenging both of these defenses. And we're ready for more football here in quarter number two. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. And he's taken down right around the 20. From their own 20-yard line, second down. Set up a little screen, gets it to his tailback. Number four takes his end of the at the 17 yard line. That'll make it third and 13. It's third down and 13 to go. Ball on the 17. When you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Poole is back deep to return. He makes it to the 42-yard line. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. He's going to try and scramble, and he's leveled at the 38-yard line. That'll make it second and seven. From the 38-yard line, second down. Fires out to his wideout, and he's tackled in the open field. That makes it third and three. He makes it to the 32-yard line. It's fourth down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. He gets out to about the 17-yard line. Hoping to go up two touchdowns here. Go, D. Let's go. Watch the team. Watch the team. Watch the team. Set. Blue 14. Blue hot. And they'll score. He punched that in from a short distance. He had great blocking up front on that play. And he tacks on the extra point. Felder gets set to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The defense shut him down on their last drive, forcing a quick punt. And down he goes at the 
49. Good job by the offensive line to pick up the linebacker on the blitz. That gave the quarterback enough time to find his man for a nice game. It's first and ten. Ball on the 49. Fights forward to about the 49. Flips it middle to the running back, and he hits him hard to the 37 yard line. From the 37 yard line. It's first down. Fires quick. He's got another one. They completed it, but for a minimal gain. It's not much, but at least it's positive yards. Second down and seven coming up here. Ball on the 34. The Bears running back. He was injured earlier. You see him down there on the sideline, and it looks like he's ready to get back in the game. He's scrambling. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. Brought down at about the 19-yard line. They move the sticks after another first down. Impressive drive by this offense so far. I really like what they're doing by keeping this defense on their heels and moving the ball downfield. Inside the 10. Nice play to set up first and goal. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, you've got the defense right where you want it. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. He makes it out to maybe the seven-yard line. That's a gain of two on the play. That brings him second and goal. And this play is number eight on the drive. Tackle made right around the four-yard line. That makes it third and goal. He's on the run. And he can't get away from the pressure. It's fourth down. This isn't much more than an extra point. It's up, and it is good. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Here's the halfback. And they make the stop at the 38. As they head to the locker rooms, this one is far from over. 21, 10. We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Both of these defenses are opportunistic. They're very good at forcing turnovers. But both quarterbacks, David, have done a very good job while trying to maintain an aggressive mindset. They haven't forced the ball. The runners have done a good job keeping it put away. Yeah, and as much as you preach that all throughout the week, it's still hard to do. It's hard to execute. And 
being able to see what you see on the defensive side of the football and adjust to it offensively. How about protecting the quarterback so he's not getting hit from the blind side, fumbling the football, ball carriers running with the football, keeping it tight to their body, not giving it away. So, you know, between running backs, receivers, and quarterbacks, offensive linemen blocking, did a great job executing on the offensive side of the football, not to, create, not to give away any turnovers. I can only hope that Nestler and Herb Street will bring the same type of intensity to their call of the second half that David and I have brought to the halftime show. Of course, they always do. That's it for us here in the studio. Time to get you back out to the guys for the second half. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He's taken down right around the 24-yard line. A one-yard loss. Not much going on there. Those kind of plays will not work against this defense. You can be sure of that. From their own 24-yard line, it's second down. There's a strike complete. He's tackled around the 27-yard line. Short over the middle. That'll be a two-yard gain. Nice grab there by the tailback to at least move the ball forward for some positive yards. Nolan awaits the snap. Cool. Fields it at the 35. He's tackled at the 42-yard line. This offense has really seemingly been unstoppable. Should be interesting to see now if the defense has changed things up as they try to stop these guys. Makes it to the 47. That's not everyday speed you're talking about with this guy. This is a unique burst combined with a really impressive field vision. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 47-yard line. A little toss across the middle. They'll bring him down at the 43. Tackle at about the 33-yard line. Call it a gain of 10 yards. That makes it first and 10. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 33. tackled around the 18-yard line. Guys, I really like what the offensive coordinator is doing here. Throwing it on first and second down will keep the defense guessing. First and 10. Ball on the 18-yard line. Play and it's going to be first and goal. That makes it first and goal. Second and goal. Ball on the three. Watch the 
Throws it and it's caught for the touchdown. I like how the quarterback, the offensive line, and the receivers made a concerted effort to get into the end zone. Converts the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Let's see if this drive has a more rewarding conclusion than their last, which ended with a punt. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. And he tackles him hard at the 41. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. They run left and he'll lose yardage. From the 48-yard line, second down. He scrambled. Slides down. So they go on the ground and pick up another first down. They are stringing together a nice little drive here. If they keep this up, it'll be hard to keep them out of the end zone. now is how will they respond after losing a couple on that run bring up second and 12. from the 34 yard line it's second down and he throws it away Zips it to the back. He gets hit out of bounds at the 18-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 18. Taken down at the three. That's a team of that makes it first and goal. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. And they hit him in the backfield. He knew it was a run all the way. Got a good jump. Once he got there, he wasn't about to let him slip away either. From the seven-yard line, second down. And he gets a yard on the run. That's good for a game of one yard. That makes his third and goal. Here's the 11th play of the drive. Mike 
for his tight end over the middle. And down he goes around the three-yard line. Wolf picks him up about three yards with the catch. So it's fourth down. This should be an easy field goal. Kicks away, and he's got it. Nolan's ready to kick. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 23-yard line. This offense just torched the defense through the air with a great passing attack on their last drive. So much of the passing game is about the timing between the quarterback and his wide receivers. Right now with this offense, they are in sync, and really the timing and execution is flawless. It's not over yet, folks. We head to the fourth quarter, 28-13. in this very pivotal fourth quarter. He's going to try and scramble. Brought down around the 42-yard line. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. impresses me is the decision making. He sees an opening, decides to turn it upfield, and gets a nice gain and a first down. Here's an opening. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. To the 20. He goes down at the 14 yard line. First down. First and ten following that big run. What a play, and that is first and goal. You talk about a dual threat guy. This guy can hurt you in the air or on the ground. Scrambling around. And he hits him hard at the one. That brings him second and goal. It's second and goal. Ball on the one yard line. And he's got the touchdown. So they punch it in on the ground, Kirk Herbstreit. Great job up front by the offensive line. They get a good, strong push that allowed the runner to get it in there for the touchdown. And he hits the PAT. Felder has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. It's fielded at the two. And down he goes at the 20. Well, the defense held him to three on their last possession. Pitching a shutout on this drive would be even better. He's scrambling. Runs with it, and he's got room. He's out to the 30. And they push him out around the 32-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 32. That's a great tackle at the 22. But the defense is fired up, responding and reacting to that sack. Not only did they get the quarterback, but they hit him and hit him hard 
I think that can really create some confidence for this defense. The next time this quarterback drops back to throw, you got to be thinking he's going to be a little bit gun shy and concerned about the pressure that these defense is putting on him. Less than three minutes in the game. Decides to tuck it in and he's got space. Tackle made at the 32. From their own 32 yard line. Third down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. They hook up over the middle. And they make the stop around the 45 yard line. That makes it first and ten. Throws incomplete. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 45. And he is drilled at the 34. Screen pass gets it to the back. He's taken down around the 33 yard line. That makes it fourth and long. There are two minutes to go in this football game. The punt upcoming, and they're going to come after this one. down at the 45 yard line both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead this defense has really got to step it up and make a stop just under two minutes in the game gains his way to the 39 yard line From the 39-yard line, it's first down. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That's a gain of six on the ball. That'll make it second and four. Carries the ball for a nice game. That's good to have gained five yards. First down. Mike eight. Mike eight. And this one's all but wrapped up with the final score 35 13. So that wraps things up for us for EA Sports and Kirk Kirk Street. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.